Channel Chimp version 2 offers a new way to control Moto with web browser projects. To get started, open Channel Chimp and go to File, Preferences. And on the first general tab, you'll see a listing for the web browser providing an address that needs to be entered into the web browser on your smartphone, tablet, or even your desktop. Now that device needs to be on the same local area network. So for example, your smartphone or tablet would need to be connected to the same Wi-Fi as the computer that's running ChannelChimp. In this case, we've got this address, 192.168.1.42 colon 9080. So we'll enter that on the tablet and press go. Now we can see all the ChannelChimp web projects available. Back in Preferences, if we go to the Web Browser tab, you can also see a list of all the web projects that are currently installed, along with the description and the version number. Now, if there is a project you don't want, you can select it and choose Delete Project. Or, if there is a new project that you want to install, you can choose Add Project and install it here. As well, at the top is the HTTP port that is being used for the web projects, and it's currently set by default to 9080, but if that port's in use on your network, you could change it to whatever you prefer. Accompanying the project tutorials are a series of files. For example, here's the file set that comes with the vehicle assembly. Now, with many of them, you'll find this file called a CCP file. And these are the web project files. So again, we can see here this 1.0.4 is the version. And if we open back up our uh, preferences and go to web browser, we could compare that against the 1.0.4 for the steering control here versus the 1.0.4 for the CCP. So whenever you're downloading files, you want to check to see if the version is more recent in the one that accompanies a tutorial. And if so, then you'll want to install it in place of the one that's already there. Now you could use the add projects to install a CCP, or there's another even more convenient way to do so. And that is by just dragging and dropping the CCP file onto the channel chimp main window. And as you can see, it says installed the plugin for steering control, and it tells you that it was already current, so it didn't have to update it. It's also possible to install multiple web browser projects. For example, I can multi-select these and drag and drop them all onto the channel chimp window. As you can see, they are all current. To use a project, just select it on the device. It's very important to note that if your device goes to sleep or if you reboot the ChannelChimp application, that you'll need to press the refresh button in the web browser on your device to reestablish communications.